time for warrior three. Uh, this pose is a challenging pose. It's a balancing pose. Um, the thing I really like about it is we can take it, even though it's challenging, we can really take it as far as is appropriate uh, for each of us, okay? So let's see how it works. From the top of your mat, standing in your mountain pose, where we typically start, okay? Let's shift the weight over into the left leg, okay? So standing through the left leg, reaching through the crown of the head, you might just lift the right heel off the floor. You might keep the toes on that right foot in contact. Always when we're balancing, nice steady gaze. Find a spot out in front of you and rest your eyes upon that, okay? If you wanna take it a little bit further, maybe you lift that right foot off the floor and you start to reach that heel back behind you. So you're straightening through that right leg, okay? Lift through the center of your chest, reach through the crown of your head. Maybe you can sweep the arms up overhead, okay? Similar to what we might do in our chair pose. Okay, reach that length into your entire body. Reach through the right heel, lift through the chest, reach through the crown of the head, extend through your fingertips. Okay, nice steady breath, nice steady gaze. If you want to take it a little bit further, you might just hinge at your waist and you start to lift that right heel, that right leg, and allow the chest to tip forward. Okay. If you start to lose control, if your arms start to drop, or if you start to bend that back leg, you've probably gone too far. So just bring it back up, find that length again, okay? And then when you feel comfortable, maybe tip a little bit less. Eventually, you might tip all the way so you're perpendicular, uh, you're uh, parallel to the floor, and you're reaching through that right heel forward through the fingertips and the crown of the head. Okay, but anywhere in between is fine. When you're ready to make your way back up, save a little bit so that you can take an inhale, mindfully draw back up, set that right foot back down, and you can release the hands. Pause, take a few breaths, and repeat it on the other side. 